Alright guys, I could not be more excited to show you today the new Audi Pure 11 Pro in black, running white, and slime. Obviously you can see the size 8. This is the initial launch of the brand new shoe in the Audi Pure line. This is the first time I've opened this box, so I'm pretty excited about it. And I've had a chance to, you know, we've been sampled on these, we've seen them, all that good stuff, so, you know, I have a pretty good idea of what, what we're looking at here. But I haven't really had a chance to, you know, really put hands on them yet. So you get to see them the first time I get to see them. But anyway, um, this is the first offering in the Audi Pure line that is entirely, um, with the exception of the Audi Questra, that is entirely my coach ready, as you can see. And uh, so by we're told by this time next year, everything in Adidas's line will be my coach ready. So, but in truth, that may actually be sooner. Um, but anyway, so yeah, here you are. Here's your new Audi Pure 11 Pros. Uh, actually, I wanted to share with you guys, too, we're actually going to have a free kick video up on these tonight, so, uh, you know, definitely stay tuned for that. We'll show you, uh, you know, what kind of flight you get out of the ball, and obviously honest reviews of what the shoe actually fits and feels like, so. But anyway, um, adjustments between the three and the four. Um, biggest thing, really, is the forefoot uh, on these ones. It's really not, uh, really not a huge difference between the three and the four as far as the rest of the shoe is concerned. But the forefoot is really the big deal. The forefoot you have, first of all, as you can see just by looking at these studs, the studs right at the back of the forefoot, these ones right here, are obviously considerably larger than the studs at the front and the rear of the forefoot. The ones in the middle are the largest ones. Uh, the idea behind that is actually kind of the same theme as the CTR 360s, the Maestri 2. It's for what they call 360 degree movement. Really and truly all it really means is that these studs have a little bit more balance in the forefoot. And they also will, uh, you'll find that they, uh, they uh, release out of the turf a little bit easier too. So that's actually a big time bonus. Uh, we're kind of used to, you know, collectively, uh, the soccer market is kind of used to shoes that, you know, have a bit more traction but don't have as much release. And this is definitely a step in the right direction. Um, apart from that, the other thing about the forefoot that's pretty cool is that it's flexible in every direction. So as you can see, it's actually, you can twist it and bend it it actually moves with your foot as opposed to the forefoot in other shoes that is a little bit less flexible and so as a result you know when you're uh, you know making sharp cuts and stops and things like that it's uh, you know the foot the shoe doesn't necessarily move with your foot this one definitely does um, material on the forefoot right here right along through here this little strip where you see that slime color it's actually a really gritty kind of tacky material you can see for yourself there there's a lot of grit to it uh, the idea behind that is Truthfully, it's uh, for those of us who drag their feet, it's meant to be, um, you know, some sort of barrier uh, to essentially keep the shoe, you know, lasting a little bit longer. Whether it works or not, we don't really know yet, but we'll, uh, we'll get to the bottom of that, no problem. As you can see, the profile, the upper, we'll get it kind of, you know, at a low angle here, but the profile, the upper, you can definitely see is considerably different from the Audi Pier 3, I'm mean, sorry, the Audi Pier 4s. There's a lot more space pulled up top here, just like in the initial release of the Audi Pure 4, the one that we actually liked. Um, so that's actually, you know, obviously we're, we're huge fans of that. Anytime you go back to what works, we're, uh, we're on board for that. Uh, the forefoot, like I said, actually the shape is a lot different than the previous one. As you can see, there's a lot less substantial toe box there, so that's definitely a bonus. Um, rear, uh, you know... Heel studs right here, really nothing special about them. As you can see, they are conical studs. Um, definitely a departure uh, for the Audi Pure line. So that's, uh, well, again, that remains to be seen how well that works. But, you know, it's kind of, uh, you know, kind of doing competition with uh, with Nike's Tiempo line. So you can see why that would, you know, that would be attractive to them. But at the same time, the Tiempos, as you know, do not have conical heel studs so we'll see what that does for traction again the idea is 360 degree movement so obviously round studs make more sense for that the sock liner is definitely different um, no more ridge through the heel that's obviously a bonus no doubt about that but uh, the other aspect to it is the material is kind of uh, it's kind of good news bad news to be honest it's uh, it's like a suede material on the surface of the of the sock liner um, as you can see, no pour-on inserts or anything like that. It's just a straight sock liner here. But um, this surface material, the one that's uh, stitched onto the top of it, it's like a suede material. I mean, you can see for yourself it's uh, definitely a different texture than the, uh, than the last ones. But it's, uh, like we said, it's a suede material. But it is, um, 
it's slippery a little bit, so you know we're worried that uh, once you start sweating in it, you're going to find that it slides around. But again, that remains to be seen. Um, we'll check that out in the video tonight. I'll definitely be asking our uh, our guys some questions and see what we can figure out there. And but other than that, it is really comfortable. It's definitely soft, and you know it's got a it's got a nice feel to it, and it is a little tackier, so it sticks to your sock when you're not sweating. But like I said, we'll uh, we'll test it out and see how it does. But anyway, um, thanks for tuning in, guys. There's your new Audi Pure, your 11 Pros. Um, we have two colors out right now. Um, we are shipping. Uh, they are out and available right this second, so if you need a pair, you know where to go. Um, they're 135 bucks on goldstore.com. They retail at 150 so obviously you know you're getting a little value there, too. But check them out. we got both colors, both of the launch colors out already. So thanks for tuning in, guys, and uh, look for that video tonight. Thanks.